got to start somewhere. So why don't we start with Maid? That's kind of the, right. the, the, the in the forefront right now. Uh, Dave Schiff, who's the creative director and founder, and, and Scott Prindle and John Kieselhorst. Um, I think they were sort of like riffing on things to do. And uh, Dave and I are best friends, and we would meet for uh, coffee in the morning sometime. And uh, he um, would just, you know, I'm thinking about this, or it's an app agency, or we're going to do a, you know, event agency, or like, you know, what do you think smart? You know what I'd really like to do? I'd like to do an agency where you just worked on things that were made in America. And, and I was just like, that's what you should do. You should always do what you really would like to do. Right. So that might be the thing. He's like, but that's stupid, you know? And, um, but what did you say? I thought it was, no. actually, I saw what it was. I was like, oh, that's got to be your brainchild. No, no. But I mean, it was in the zeitgeist, and I did encourage him and said, it is not a bad idea. You know, sacrifice has to be part of anything, I think. You know, what you do work on and what you don't work on and, right. you know, focus. So to me, it seemed like something that was going to be probably a, you know, good 10-year trend where I think we were kind of waking up to, well, we sent a little bit too many things offshore. There's a connection between R&D and manufacturing that we don't want to lose. You know, there's a, there's a drain of brain power as well as labor. I'm an investor just because I think it's a neat idea and it matches my values. Right. And I'm an advisor because I've you know, done some agency stuff in the past. So I okay. can, can kind of help guide them with that. And it's, it's great. It's great fun. I didn't realize until I saw you in New York City that you said made was X percent retail, X percent agency, and you kind of described it more as an agency concept first. Mm -hmm. Am I the only one that first sees it and thinks it's kind of this collaborative of finding and marketing great brands that are made in America? I think there's definitely been some confusion around it because I think that the store is to, I think for them to put their money where their mouth is and kind of participate in actually supporting businesses that are making things here. Made starts also with a philosophy about, you know, marketing being something that is more about what you make than just about what you say. So a lot of their clients, they're really, you know, deeply involved in what's happening digitally. Because right. in the digital space, you can create a lot of value for, for your client. So something sure. like Pizza Tracker, you know, you're creating a ton of value that was locked up in the system that nobody really saw. Okay, That's so they're part exciting. of that. So the, so the made philosophy is about making. And then the other part of the made philosophy is that, hey, we want to support things that create jobs. Right. Because that's where, that's where they get really fired up. They don't have to go to work and, and fake any sort of passion. The passion's really there because everything they work on is aligned with, with their values.